Hey guys, gonna give you some tips and tricks about the AVH P8400PH Pioneer head unit when using the Navi, the a AVIC U250. Problem that I was running into was I hooked up everything right. I got the right bypass, the new micro bypass, so I could watch videos and have Navi while driving. But no matter what I did, when I pressed mode, I got a black screen. I actually returned the Navi once thinking that the navigation unit they had sent me was bad. Nowhere in any manuals did they tell me that you need to go to your system and change the RGB input from iPhone, which it's naturally set, to navigation. Once you do that, you press mode and your navigation will pop up, no problem because it's a very simple hookup and there's no problems hooking it up and hiding the antennas and such but once you do that you'll be all good the navigation is actually really good it has cool animation screens and when the road splits it has cool things also a little tip to get pictures for cool backgrounds like that I have the Star Wars background a lot of JPEGs do not work with this unit because even though in the book it says they have to be a certain size the book is incorrect you need to find a way to export for device I do that through Photoshop for the JPEGs and um, once you export for device then they all come up when you go to search for them um, there's a couple little tricks you gotta figure it out with the unit but it is a great unit um, I hope this Pioneer AVIC U250 tip helps people because I was reading book after book after book and couldn't figure out why I just kept getting a black a blank screen. Uh, again, just so you to reiterate, you go into your systems and you make sure the RGB input is in on Navi. They do not tell you that in any manual. So that'll help you and get your navigation working right away. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.